Hey guys, welcome to Cute Tea Drawings. Today I'll be drawing Kinger from the Amazing Digital Circus. I'll be drawing on my tablet, but you can also follow along on paper, and please remember to like and subscribe. Okay, now let's get started. Okay, let's first start off at the top, and let's draw the head. Let's start by drawing the eyes. Let's draw the first eye with a circle here. And then the other eye, we're going to draw on the right and lower, like this. Now inside each one, let's add another circle. And then let's add another circle inside the center. And then color both of these in black. And lastly, inside on the top left, let's add another smaller circle. And that's it for the eyes. Now let's zoom in and finish drawing the head. Let's start next to the top eye and let's draw a curve over to the right. Then for the end, let's angle it down and continue it on the other side of the eye. And the same thing angling down from the left. And then add a curve across the bottom. Next, let's hop to the top and let's draw a curve in the center. And then bring it up on both sides. Now on the bottom left, let's curve it down to the eye. And then all the way down on the right. Now let's hop back up to the top and let's draw a curve around and back up, leaving a gap in the center. Now in the gap, let's draw a cross shape. Let's start with the curve across. Then bring it up on both sides. Now for the sides, let's bring it out, up, and back in. And then from the top, lines up. And then close off the top. And that's it for the top part of the head. Now let's move down and let's draw the neck. From the bottom left, let's curve it out, underneath, and back around the other side. Now underneath, on both sides, let's step in and let's draw a small line down. And then a curve across to connect it. Now underneath, let's draw the same curve around. And then one more larger one. And again, underneath, two small lines down. And that's it for the head and neck. Now let's start to draw the body. Underneath from the sides, let's draw two curves down, coming towards the center to a point. And let's do the same thing, starting from the side of the head. But this time, let's leave a gap in the center. Now let's zoom back out and finish drawing the body. Now let's hop back into the middle underneath the first V-shape we drew and let's curve it over to the left and then draw a wavy line all the way down. And do the same thing from the other side. But let's make this one a little bit shorter at the bottom. Now from the ends of both lines, let's curve it over to the right. And then close off the end with a curve. And let's do the same thing on the left. Let's draw two curves out. And close off the end. Now top back up to the top and let's draw the sides of the body. Let's start with a curve out, bring it in, and then down and the same on the other side. Now let's add some details to the fur by drawing some lines inside.
and that's it for the body, now let's move to the sides and add the hands. Let's leave a gap and on both sides let's draw a curve up and then a curve underneath. Now underneath from the inside, let's draw the first finger by bringing it out, down, and curve it up. Then on both hands, let's add two more curved fingers. And then one more to close off each hand. And that's it for Kinger, now let's quickly color it in. And done. Hope you enjoyed drawing along with me and please remember to hit that like button and subscribe for more videos. Thanks for watching.